when looking at Ohio State's team uh, for this 2022 football season, it's been clear and, ap- and apparent, you know, from the moves that Coach Day has made, you know, following the 2021 season that defense needed to be changed. Um, and it's been changed. We have new new defensive coordinator and Coach Knowles. He's no nonsense. He's not messing around. And we've seen guys enter the, the transfer portal because they're not playing. And he does bring a, a complex type of mindset in terms of terminology and how he wants things done. And, and not everyone, you know, is adapted to it or is used to that, that type of uh, defense. And, you know, and one person that – that gets the opportunity to see it on a on a day to day basis or or when they do practice in pads is C J Stroud the quarterback, and he's he's basically so basically told the media how he's seen a, a big difference. He said they have different ways to get into different coverages, which is really good for my eyes. We're not just seeing cover one, cover three, the same coverages. So I mean, obviously when you're a quarterback, you you pretty much. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing if you know what kind of defensive scheme your defense is running. But basically, he's kind of alluding to, I don't really know what type of coverage you're going to be in. I don't know what type, what are they going to be in each time. It's a lot different versus last year. He pretty much, Ohio State pretty much ran the same thing. And then obviously it went really, it was apparent that one thing that, that was mentioned a lot is how Ohio State used their safeties, I believe, up until the Oregon game. And then, or a little bit after that, and then they ended up switching to how to use their safeties and how they play defense. So if anybody watching the game, calling the game to see that, obviously C.J. Stroud's seen that in practice all the time. He's saying that's not the case where we know, okay, at this point in the season, Ohio State just scrapped how they were doing things defensively and went, a safety's going to be this way. He's saying now every time they're practicing or, or going through different plays, plays during, de- during different you know, type of formations and stuff, which is, I mean, for him, that's that's very good because when you play Penn State, when we, well, okay, we're going one game. When you play Notre Dame, we don't really know what they're going to be in, you know. I, we don't know Marcus Freeman's a, a brand-new head coach, you know. We don't know how things – I mean, obviously, he's a, a tremendous defensive coach, but sometimes – Coaches change from when they're just a coordinator to the head coach. They might change a little things up. And it's the first game of the season, so we don't know. We don't have time to, to you know, maybe scout them or anything. They're probably not going to show much in their spring game. So, you know, for him to see different defenses, you know, now in practice, it's only going to prepare him for that Notre Dame game because we don't have any film versus playing opponents down the line. We will have tape on how they do defenses and what guys they like to roll with, but this Notre Dame, we don't know. So for him to see that, it's, it's really good. And, and that's something you like to hear, that Ohio State's not going with the status quo. They're actually trying to improve and get better defensively because if they get better defensively, the sky's definitely the limit. And uh, C.J. Stroud is seeing it, and hopefully it comes to fruition when they face Notre Dame on in September.